What's up YouTube? So in this video I'm going to do a review of a product that I was sent for free that I think looks pretty dang cool. And then at the end of the video we're going to open up this heavy base set pack. This is for Michael... I about to say his last name. I'm glad I didn't think of it because then I might have just said it. No, we had to start this video over. So we're going to start off with this product review we have right here. Dear TCA Gaming, I'm a huge fan of your YouTube channel. While watching your videos I noticed that you lean the cards on the wall. Hopefully these custom made card stands will say, solve that problem. These card stands were designed by myself, an Autodesk inventor, and then 3D printer. I hope to see them in use on your YouTube videos. It would mean a lot to me. Also selling them on eBay. My username is Count Omar. Enjoy. Omar PS keep up the great work. What I'll do for you guys is if you actually want some of these stands, which I'm getting ready to show them to you. I will link his eBay store right down here in the description. All you gotta do is go check it out. In fact, by using that link, if you do go buy anything, even if you don't buy these stands, it'll really help out. But hopefully, you guys will like the stands. All right, so let's see what we have here. So the first one I have, check it out. He put Charizard on it. I guess he can customize them. So let's test it out. So I just got in this Primeape, and I'm using a perfect fitted sleeve. So I don't know if the sleeve's gonna affect it or not. We'll just have to see. I don't know, it fits right in there. Nice, really nice. It's a pretty good stand, and it's got that cool Charizard artwork on there. It's got a nice little color. Let's see what else he has here. I think these might be for single cards. Maybe we'll do something like that here, there, here at the end, or I'll just grab it. I imagine that you, it would need a top loader. So we got a few of those. Let's see, there's another one, TCA Gaming, and it's gray. Ooh, I kind of like the black one. Oh, that one says Team Rocket. Check that out. So I guess he can customize it to a set. So we're gonna imagine this is a. Dark Charizard, <laughs> not light out of Kazan. Wow, it looks really cool. Check that out. I guess you can kind of angle them in and out. And here's some more. He looks like he made me several of them, so that's pretty cool. Maybe we'll start using these for the better cards in the background. And then there's another Charizard one. I'm gonna go grab a top loader and a random card. At least I think I am. Hopefully you guys can hear me. Oh no. People try to call me. All right, so I got Switch. I think it's a gray stamp. Let's see what happens here. I'm not sure these are for top loaders or not. Oh, they are, check that out. So we got a top loader stand. So I guess if you like top, loader, uh, top loaded cards instead of PSA, you could just use you know, these stands for that. So if you're interested in any of these, like I said, I will link his eBay store right there down in the description and you guys can go check him out. Thank you very much. Did he say did he say he have a name for this stuff? It just says his username is Count Omar. Get you a name on the business, that'd be sweet. All right, here we go. So here's the heavy pack for Michael, spelled with a K. Well, I guess, oh no, no, it's fine. Most Michaels I think are M-I-C-H. This is, I believe I saw M-I-K for his. The K is in Mike. One, two, three, and four. Here we go. Looks like I got a voicemail. Whoever I ignored did not like that. Hopefully they don't call me back. All right, we have Gust of Wind, Abra, Onyx, Ponyta, Magnemite. There's a Water Energy, a Psychic Energy, Arcanine. Check that out. Jinx and Porygon. All right, here we go. Look at the back side. What is that? Oh, it's just a little piece. Some for, for whatever reason, there's like, sometimes there's just stuff that's on the inside of the packs. I guess from where they're open. Man, the corners look pretty good. You got a little piece of whitening down there, but otherwise not too bad. And I think that's another little dot that would come off. All right, here we go. Nine tails. Man, my heart dropped for a second. Thought it was the Zard. Oh. All right, so let's look at it. Gosh, the hollows are turning out really nice from this box. Are you guys seeing anything? Man, I'm looking pretty hard. I'm not... I don't see any print lines. Good flash around the sides. Uh, there's a little bit of silvering right there. You can kind of catch it. But really, that's a that's a very, very strong nine. Oh, bottom side. There we go. I got a little bit of silvering on the bottom side. But again, you don't really notice it too much. 
All right, so there you go, Michael. There's your hollow from your heavy base set pack. You got you a nine tails, and then you also have these commons and uncommons. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.